Hey there, welcome back to Drinks with Matt De Noon. Today we're doing a champagne. We have the pleasure of having a bottle of Philippe Gonet Blanc de Blanc Signature Brut. Um, I poured this in the glass about a moment ago. Uh, as you can see, it is rising beautifully. The bubbles are fantastic. Medium in size, some even a bit smaller. I blame the glass actually. I didn't rinse it out with water first, so we have a multitude of bubble sizes, but very nicely in queue, forming very periodically and wonderfully in line. So, what do we have? Uh, this is 100% Chardonnay from uh, the Côte de Blanc in Champagne, specifically Le Menil sur Auger. It is a stone's throw from Champagne Salon and Close de Menil. Uh, fantastic, sustainable producer. Seventh generation now with uh, the new future-oriented brother and sister team, Pierre and Chantal Gonet. Really wonderful. So let's take a look. Uh, this... 100% champagne. It's beautiful in color. It is uh, a bit of a, a pale straw almost. Uh, the mousse looks fantastic, like it would be quite frothy on the mouth. Uh, let's take a little sip. Mm. Now this is a really wonderful champagne. My gosh, and I love champagne, but who doesn't? Biting acidity, bracing. I can feel it in my teeth. My enamel can feel it, but balanced with really nice citrus fruits. And not underripe, mind you. Phenolically underripe, but really precise. Beautiful, almost bordering on riper citrus fruits. I even get a subtle amount of some bitter orange rind, which is really wonderful. This is an eclectic style of champagne. A really easy drinking, super party oriented goes with well with really good foods or on its own. Now, this is about uh, six grams per liter residual sugar at dosage. Uh, the reserve uh, champagne for this, the Vinde Reserve, 30% of it comes from a Solera system dating back 10 vintages. This really adds to a complexity and a richness in both the aromas and the mouthfeel. I think this is a fantastic style of Blanc de Blanc. It is the signature for Philippe Gonet. It is the entry level to understand what they're doing. They're really concentrating on Chardonnay. They're really coming through with riper flavors. Uh, they have a wonderful oriented character. And Champagne is very hard to navigate just realistically walking into a store and getting anything. So I encourage you, next time you're out looking for a wonderful Champagne, it's around $45 on average, Try Philippe Gonet, Blanc de Blanc, Signature Brut. It's fantastic. Thanks for watching. Drinks with Matt Denoon. Cheers.